Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna discuss boundary condition in Abacus, simply supported IBIM. Here I am Pranav. So we all know simply supported IBIM. Simply supported IBIM is like a beam where the one end will be pin support and, and another end will be roller support. So let's see. So this is simply supported beam, right? In one end pin support and another end roller support. In here, the direction 1 will be considered as in lateral direction of the beam. U2, that means in direction number 2, will be considered as the vertical direction. And U3, that means the three, uh, number 3 direction, will be considered as along the length of the beam. Okay. So if I consider this kind of direction, so pin support, in pin support, the displacement in any direction will be zero so u1 u2 u3 so all of this will be zero in roller support the condition is a little bit difficult it's not like uh, easy so let's say uh, so in in roller support u1 u1 will be zero that means direction along the lateral lateral di uh, way uh, will be zero so wave of i beam I'll, I'll discuss the later uh, later uh, u2 and u3 will be zero so u2 means the displacement along the vertical direction will be zero u3 that means rotation along the length of the beam will be zero okay so center of i beam so let's see what happened so if i uh play this video that i have created so you see here i'll just wait a minute yeah so let's start so you see i am gonna consider a frame where one column one beam is connected through the extended shear tab or shear tab whatever it is so now you see in left there is a column and in right there is a far end okay so the left of the column will be considered as pin support and the far end will be considered as roller support okay so in far end of the, uh, so uh, the column what i did so let's start so roller support this one okay so this is a 3d view so if i'm gonna show you boundary condition so the boundary one boundary condition one will be considered as the pin support you see u1 u2 u3 is zero i take all the nodes of the corner of the column section and i consider it as u1 u2 u3 is equal to zero okay so this is the condition of pin support now we are started um, the roller support this is very easy so first i first i considered all the nodes in the wave of the beam and i considered that all of the wave of the node will be displacement along the direction in lateral that means u1 will be what zero okay there will not be any displacement in lateral direction in roller support okay and next i took the center center node of the web and i considered as u2 and u3 is equal to zero that means if i take the center of the web the node and if that if there is no vertical displacement and there is no rotation along the length of the beam this will consider as uh, roller support okay so you see i take the wave of the node center wave of the node and u2 ur3 is zero okay so this is not very difficult this is very easy so this is pin condition and this is roller condition okay so here it is so today is up to this 
thank you everyone and hopefully i'll um i'll i'll, I'll create more videos uh, related to abacus and different kinds of civil engineering uh, software so thank you for watching uh, i think uh, if you if you like my video please subscribe my channel and if you have any comment comment just write down your comments thank you